What up, it's your boy T Bear on the reaction. About the reaction to the latest video from Michael Jackson. This is Michael Jackson. Wait a second. I'm about to do a Michael Jackson reaction, but what's going on with my shirt? Just give me a second. Hey, I was tripping. I can't believe I'm ready to do a Michael Jackson reaction without the shirt. So, first off, you see the shirt, you know what it is. It's time for a whew, Michael Jackson reaction. Whew. Perfect time since that the mini mission almost broke me with that damn uh, remix lyrics. From uh, remix, my damn Michael Jackson favorite song of all time. Anyway, this is from Michael Traps. So Billy Jean, I'm damn. This is if Michael Jackson had an angry translator. This is gonna be a good one. I can tell already. I wonder if this is going to beat out my Angry Michael Jackson Studio 1. Shout out, first off, first, shout out to all y'all still rocking with that. Out of all my videos, Michael Jackson videos and, and Traps and video all together, that's my most perfect video right there because don't get no fucking ideas either. My perfect video ever because that and I got not a single dislike. Got <coughs> so many views and so many likes. So anyway... I know it's going to hopefully this one be up there with them as well too. But anyway, it is if Michael Jackson has an angry translator. So what I thought to do, let's check it out. Excuse me. What's groovy, guys? Make sure you subscribe and click that notification bell so you never miss a video. Let's glow. Let's go. Round one. When you're talking about children, we met Gavin. Mm -hmm. And uh, it was a great privilege to meet Gavin because he's, yeah. he's had a lot of suffering in his life. Yeah. When Gavin was there, he talked about the fact that he shares your bedroom. Yes. Can you understand why people would worry about that? Because they're ignorant. But is it really appropriate for a 44-year-old man to share a bedroom with a child who is not related to him at all. That's a beautiful thing. That's, that's not a worrying thing. Why should it be worrying? Who's the criminal? Who's, who's Jack the Ripper in the room? This is a guy trying to help heal a child. I'm sleeping in a sleeping bag on the floor. I gave him the bed because he has a brother named Star. So him and Star took the bed and I'm on the floor in the sleeping bag. Did you ever sleep in the bed with them? No. But I have slept in the bed with many children. I sleep in the bed with all of them. When Macaulay Culkin were little, Kiri, Kieran Culkin would sleep on this side. Macaulay Culkin's on this side. His sister's in there. We're all just oh. jamming the bed. And we'd wake up like dawn and go in the hot air balloon. You know, we, would, we have the footage. We, I have all that footage. But is that right, Michael? It's very right. It's very loving. That's what the world needs now. More love, more the world. More, the world needs a heart. the world needs a man who's forty four sleeping no, in a bed with it, children. No, no, you're making <laughs> it. No, you're making it. All get, all well, get high. Me, help me. There we go. Because what's wrong with sharing love? <laughs> you don't sleep with uh, your kids or some other kid who needs love who didn't have a no, good child. No, no, no. Oh I would shit. Never dream of sleeping. I would. I would. So I would never dream. Never been, all right, man. I can't take no more. Mike, can I get him? Get him, traps. <laughs> First of all, Martin Poops here. What are you talking about? Do you know who I am? Do you know my name is Michael Jackson? Do you know where I was born? Where I grew up at? Gary <laughs> Indiana? You see the size of that house? You see the size of the family? <laughs> huh? Of course, that's how we grew up. Kids sleep on the same bed. It was yeah. like 15 of us in the same bed every night. That's what we used to. Just because we sleep in the same bed doesn't mean that our minds are going to dirty places, you sick animal. <laughs> Why are you even in my crib if you're trying to interrogate me with lies? Right. See, that's the problem with you mother <laughs> You guys always think it's some sick shit. I'm up here trying to heal the world, steal your girl, and you always trying to call me a pedophile or some creep shit. Yeah, I'm 44 years old, but now oh, I'm basically seven because I get to grow up. Because I had to work my ass off every damn day so I can have all this fortune. What you got? <laughs> Besides these little cameras. Oh, what did shit. you make? What you got? <laughs> nothing. You ain't got nothing on me. You can never live my life. You ain't never had this glow. How you gonna tell me how to be Michael Jackson? You ain't Michael Jackson. You are Martin Poop Share. And you're <laughs> such a fat one. <laughs> Round two. Here we go. What do you think people would say if I 
said, well, I've invited some of my daughter's friends round or my son's friends round and they're going to sleep in the bed with me tonight. That's fine. What do you think their parents would say? If they're wacky, they would say, you can't. But if you're a close family, like your family, you know them well and... Um, and uh, but Michael, I wouldn't like my children. That shit would not fair, is this on? Nobody else is bad. Well, I wouldn't mind if I Girl. knew the person. Look, my nigga, you not me. You not me. But kids don't fuck with you. That's the but kids don't. He said, "Look, my nigga." When the why? Because I'm the king. I'm the king of the pop pop. I'm the king of the glow. I got all the girls, and I'm groovy. You're not. Look at your face. You look like the Bert the Simpson character. <laughs> You look like Martin Poot Smear. That's what you are. Poot Smear. You ain't shit. You ain't bad. You ain't nothing. I'm Michael Jackson. I'm the most famous person in the world. Kids want to rock with me because I teach them how to dance. I teach them how to be good people. I teach them how to love. I teach them about magic. And that's very important, especially when you a kid. Mm. What do you teach them? Mm -hmm. Huh? Antagonizing them? Trying to set them up for failure? What are you teaching them? That's what I thought. You ain't teaching them a god thing. You ain't teaching them a god thing about nothing. <laughs> Let's continue. Round three. And I, like, if I'm very close to Barry Gibb, Paris and Prince can stay with him anytime. Uh -huh. My children sleep with other people all the time. Oh, okay. And you're happy with that? Fine with it. They're honest. They're sweet people. They're not Jack the Ripper. <laughs> I suppose the problem for many people is it's what happened asking. in 1993. Oh, shit. Or what didn't happen. What didn't happen. Get him. What did happen, you stupid mother? Why are you in my crib? If you believe that I touched those kids, why are you in my house? Huh? Why are you in my crib? If you think I'm a pedophile, why are you near me? Huh? Of course it didn't happen. You know what the vibes are, bruh? These kids want money. These kids want money. They want clout. They want all of my fortune. Now, if I didn't have any money, do you think these kids be saying I tried to touch them? No. We want to be none of that. You know what I'm saying? No, no, no. We want to be none of that. <laughs> these little motherfuckers and they stupid ass parents trying to come up here and get some money off of me. And you know this, man. <laughs> Let's continue. Round four. Hey, I got the four rounds. What was that like when you first heard the allegations that were being made against you? It was shocking, and I'm not allowed to talk about this by way of law. So, no, but, but how did you feel about what was being said? I'm not asking you to talk about what was said. I was shocked because, um... Yeah. Look, my I was pissed the fuck off. What do you think? If somebody tried to say you was a pedophile, how the fuck did you feel? What kind of stupid ass <laughs> is that? Yeah, I told you I can't talk about this shit. Got cases on me right now. I'm hot out here in these streets. Got cases out here. What are you talking about? Round five. Oh, oh shit, this is children. funny. But isn't that precisely the problem? That when you actually invite children into your bed, <laughs> I was straight. Children, children. The reason that's been given for why you didn't go to jail. Shut the f up. Shut the f up. Shut the f up. Shut the f up. You say one more thing, Poop Smear. Shut the f up. Shut the f up. Shut the f up. Shut the f up. You say one more thing, Poop Smear. About jail. About oh shit. What kind of interview was this? What kind of interview was this? Why the f up here? Do you want to fight right now? What's up? You go right now. What's up? Shit, we'll fight right now. <laughs> you switch. Round six. Oh, a shit. financial settlement with the family. Yeah, yeah. I don't want to do a long, drawn-out thing on TV like OJ and all that stupid stuff. And it, would, it wouldn't look right. I just said, look, get this over with. I want to go on with my <coughs> life. This is ridiculous. I've had enough. Go. Get him. My I got money for days. I'm, I'm on tour. I just put out an album. I'm on tour. I'm trying to get this bag so I can live. I'm not trying to be in court over some shit I ain't do. Some right. shit I know I ain't do. Some shit you know I ain't do. So let's cut to the chase. What do you think? You think I'm guilty? What's up? You think I'm guilty? Feel the scrap right now. What's poppin'? What's good? That's why I thought. Yeah, you ain't you scared because you ain't bad. You Too ain't bad. But a piece of poop. Piece of doo -doo. <laughs> piece of doo -doo <laughs> Miss me all that, man. Hey, Mike, can I finish him? Finish him. Thank you. I'm so sick and tired of people and peasants like Martin Poop Smear talking shit about me, trying to convince the media and the world that I'm Jack the Ripper, that I'm a pedophile. I will jack smack the shit out of all you. <laughs> I'm a Jason. All your people ain't got shit on me. But you're mad because I got Sony's catalog. You're mad because everybody looks up. You're mad because you really can't find anything on me. So you're going to try to pull this shit. You're going to pull this? Really? <laughs> Good luck. Because guess what? Ten years of investigating ain't nothing. You ain't got nothing on the king. You <laughs> win. Sorry about that, Mike. I'm just trying to get on how to set the record straight for you. It's all good. Hey, you trying to go climb a tree? Sure. As long as it's a magical one. All right, let's go. <laughs> oh, God. That was funny. That was hilarious. 
I ain't think it'll be that for him, but that was hilarious. Oh shit. Mm -mm -mm. Oh my god. Anyway. If you like my reaction, like, share, subscribe to my YouTube channel. It's your boy T Bird. Hell, that was she was for you. Like, oh my god. Like, he. I wanted that. Like, he. I know Mike had been real talk when in real life was asked to be pissed. I don't question he was asking for him, man. But anyway, long live the king, Michael Jackson. It's your boy T Bird signing off. One love.